New at noon, Orlando's planning board is moving forward with new rules aimed at cracking down on crime downtown. The regulations target businesses open late at night. News 6's Mark Lehman explains the changes and what has to happen next before it's official. Today's meeting comes after we've seen several violent incidents in downtown Orlando over the last year. The city saying it's laser focused on reducing crime, leading to proposed changes. Orlando's Municipal Planning Board hearing a presentation this morning to clamp down on the party atmosphere sometimes seen in downtown. We're going to, from a more reactive code enforcement scheme to a more proactive way. Three amendments are being proposed to deter crime and other problems like this shooting from March. That's when police say an innocent bystander was shot. One of the proposals calls for new businesses to apply for a special use permit and show a safety plan if they want to serve alcohol after midnight. So if you have a business that might be open to the public after midnight, we're asking for a, a, a planning permit, if you will. Another amendment applies to parking lots where the city says a lot of crime originates. Owners may be required to implement a security plan and block off lots when closed. Those that are profiting off of that parking, you know, are going to have to do some minimal standards in order to operate after that 10 p.m. The issue of noise was also addressed. Planners are calling to change the level to 85 decibels, which they say will help reduce noise complaints. Each of the proposals receiving unanimous approval. The amendments didn't receive any pushback from business owners during today's meeting or any public comment. Those proposals are now set to go in front of the city council next month. In Orlando, Mark Lehman getting results, New 6.